What is going on, Star Wars fans? We are back, and we're going to be talking about Ahsoka Tano spinoff series. Now, I was thinking about this earlier, and I figured I'd go ahead and share this with you guys. I think there's a bigger possibility we can get an Ahsoka spinoff series now, because now we know that she is alive uh, due to the latest episode of Star Wars Rebels. If you guys did not watch that, go ahead and go watch that. It is on my channel, so... By all means, check that out. I did talk about that. But spoilers, she is alive. She was saved by Ezra in the World of Worlds when she was fighting Vader. And then she went back through the portal. And she goes deep, deeper in the Labyrinth Temple of the Jedi Temple. So, here is some theories that I think that would work for Ahsoka. I think it'd be great to see Ahsoka either right after she leaves the Order or how whatever she does with her spare time or whatever she does when she's not working with the rebellion or when she wasn't with the ghost crew or like how she dealt with the fact of knowing her master and her friend turned into the greatest evil villain now that the world has to has to deal with or the universe has to deal with and i think that'd be pretty great to see because a lot of people have been wanting some type of an uh, ahsoka show or movie um honestly uh i wouldn't mind if it was either animated or live a lot of people want to see live some people want to see the animated version and i think either one will work as long as it does great on the story which i think it would be if uh dave filoni probably does do the uh the story because he, he does an amazing job because he actually did a great job adding up what happened in season two to now and it adds up perfectly and for timeline as well and I think he if he if he got it or if JJ Abrams got it or, or somebody that we know is able to handle it then I think it'd be written possibly just great and to see what kind of characters we also see that would possibly come back like there's been so many theories about um Rex or Ezra or Sabine. Um, we also know that Kane's gone. <clears throat> we know that everyone pretty much goes their own way within the rebellion. Uh, at probably more likely at the end. So why can't we see something out of Ahsoka going on her own path? Because she ain't a full rebel. She ain't a Jedi. She's not a Sith. She just kind of goes her own way, and she just shows up when she's needed. Like she's shown up when she was needed at the Jedi Temple. She shown up when we were needed with the Inquisitors, and she showed up again when Palpatine tried to take Ezra. So pretty much she shows up when she's needed. So I think that's what makes Ahsoka so great is, you know, she was a powder one for so many years and then she turned into um just a great warrior and a protector of ones that can't really understand something themselves and she's still learning herself. So I think that it would be great to see Ahsoka in something. Again, um <clears throat> whether it has to do with Vader or it has to do with something with the Empire or it has something to do with right after she was Jedi Order. Just something that everybody can enjoy and everyone can actually see more of Ahsoka. Because, again, we've only seen so much Ahsoka with the Clone Wars and Star Wars Rebels. And she's such a lovable character. And her story's amazing. Her, um, just the way that she is as a character. Because she is a beloved character. And I like Ahsoka a lot. And I was so happy to finally see her return. And that she was alive. And how she has slowly dealt with the fact of knowing that Darth Vader is Anakin. And also that Kanan's gone. And Ezra has to move on from Kanan. She had to help Ezra do that as well as also what um she told him to do you need to move on and she made a promise to try to get to him as fast as she can and maybe she will maybe she won't maybe something's going to happen to Ezra and then she's going to go on her own we need to figure out what happened to Ahsoka on how come she is not around in <clears throat> in the actual movies and maybe they'll show that maybe they won't it all depends on who writes it if it's going to happen uh if Ahsoka gets killed at the end of Rebels. We really don't know. So hopefully she won't. But if she doesn't if she doesn't get killed, then I think a spinoff series would do her character justice. So let me know what you guys think about this in the comments down below. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Uh, share, the, share your thoughts down in the description below if you guys think this should be an Ahsoka TV show. Also, what you guys think about how Star Wars Rebels is right now. How do you think how it was when she returned? Uh, if you guys want to give me a follow, go ahead and links down in the description below as normal. Also, subscribe again if you would like. If you like the content I provide on this channel, click the notification bell so you guys do not miss none of my videos as well hope you guys are enjoying your day your night wherever you may be located and i'll be seeing you on the next video